Hello there folks, I'm Dan Brown from sortofinteresting.com and today you're joining me as we put together the contents of this box to hopefully create another one of those desks that you've just seen. So this is going to be a very quick unboxing build and general review and thoughts of the Argos Malibu 3 drawer desk or dressing table depending on what you want to call it I suppose. And these are desks that have been about for absolute ever and I think at the moment the retail price is around 50 quid and obviously that changes in sales and stuff every now and then so always keep an eye out for well, the next discounts but basically these are desks that have been around forever and I can remember going back years and years and years to having a computer sat on one of these well a long long time ago and I just thought well well I'm uh, putting all my furniture together moving into a new place I would do a few videos of things like this so as I say I have been sat at a desk like this for goodness knows how long probably well over a decade I would say and the design very slightly changes and alters over the years of like, for example, you'll see later that the drawers on this particular one have those metal roller things, whereas previously the one that I've got that I'm currently recording this uh, voiceover at, that you can hear me tapping now, has just got plain plastic runners with no physical attachment to the drawer, just simple... Well, again, this is all distraction you don't really need to know about. But basically, the long and short of it is that it might take, I don't know, half an hour to an hour depends on how serious you are about getting this done to put it all together but really when it comes to the finished product for 50 quid you can't argue and like you say the fact that this must be probably about the fifth one that i've um, built myself as there's at least one more still at my mum's house that unfortunately i couldn't fetch with me as it i'd sort of donated that to be a bit of an office desk <laughs> But ultimately, like I say, the fact that I've been sat at one of these, like, editing videos and writing books and just playing games and stuff for over a decade is about a testament to it that I wanted to go out and buy another one straight away, um, as you can get. So it gets the big damn brown thumbs up. This particular one that I built in this video, I decided to set up with the drawers and the shelves the opposite way around because it was going in the bedroom. And really, there's nothing bad to say about this. It's like, as long as you're not expecting it to be like a really heavy, solid oak piece of furniture and you're going to be able to like sit on it or something, then you're not going to find any issues with it in just general daily use. And like you say, I mean, I'm more than happy to currently own a minimum of three of them right now. Um, but yeah, like you say, a nice, simple desk. Excellent price for it, I would say and ultimately well worth the money and I have no reason to doubt that I won't be sat at these for years to come. Until the next time, keep it interesting, have a fantastic day and of course, farewell!